gamingfreak.com Hello and welcome. Welcome back to a, another spotlight video. So today we are having a uh, quick look at, well, quick look, 10 minutes of look at the uh, the charge sniper rifle. Um, as many of you know, I don't normally don't normally snipe. Uh, I made a an alternate character to do this, an alt to do this. Um, during the triple skill point event, he ran the the twelve or so uh, matches or ten. I think I ran twelve matches with him, including academy. And uh, I didn't know what to do with him, and then I just thought, well. I can pretty much do most things, you know, run and gun, scout, heavy, and commando, and that. But I never really sniped. So what I'm what I'm doing here is just I was just testing to see if it's worth ever skilling into on my main character. But what I what I did here is I took the Kaldari commando drop suit to <laughs> check this guy out as well. <laughs> I took the uh, Kaldari commando drop suit to three and then just to get some increased damage and then I just put the the sniper rifle to uh, 5 with proficiency 2 after some matches and uh, ammo capacity 1 but that was after this match had been recorded with the proficiencies and stuff um, but if you think about it my character's under 3 million skill points and being really quite effective here as you can see uh, I am using mouse and keyboard, which does help uh, con considerably, actually, with uh, sniping. And it, it allows me just to be that little bit more accurate, you know, than, than I would with a controller. During closed beta, I did, uh, I used a friend's PS3. This is before I owned a PS3. I wanted to see how good Dust was. This is when I was still playing a lot of EVE. And um, <coughs> what I found was, with practice with the controller, you can get really good if you if you don't mind uh, waiting on the being very uh, careful with how you use the controller. Um, but obviously, the mouse just gives you that that bit of reaction time and movement that you otherwise wouldn't have. As you can see there, just the ability to to whack out some headshots and quickly move accurately to to other points just makes such a difference. And and to when especially when people are still, I mean, it, you can really hold it very still on the mouse, which is which is good. So about the charge sniper, you press and hold fire to charge it all the way. Uh, when I read in the description that you can do rapid fire, I actually thought that um, that would that meant that you could you know ping off shots quickly or charge the sniper rifle. Uh, however, what it actually means is if you fully charge, you get a lot of damage, and if you half charge, you you get less damage basically, but you can fire quicker. So you can see me using that on some of the kills here just to try and quickly finalize the kill so to speak um, and I think you'll see it later on a, on a heavy or two as well um, this guy was running and he had a, a cloaky also running with him but I couldn't see the cloaky after a little while so I just focused on him I find the blur on the outside of the the scope doesn't help with seeing things with the <laughs> with the sniper so yeah, it's, it's it was uh, very. I actually really enjoyed it. It was a bit different to what I was used to. Uh, it's actually quite relaxing <laughs> in a in an odd, sadistic kind of way. Um, but yeah, no, it was it was pretty relaxing to just sit up high. I wasn't being counter sniped, which was really lucky, considering where I was um, considering where I was sitting. I could have been very easily uh, counter sniped, but but I was lucky to not be in and it meant I could get some really nice footage and show how if you're in a nice vantage point sniping and uh, if you're not getting counter sniped like I wasn't so 
you know it's it can it can be really fun actually and this was a, a really good game as well where they were really focused on the points and I was just focused on stopping them moving between the points too much so there you could see I used the half charge just to quickly sneak a shot in if I could and it, it ended up paying off which was uh, probably a bit lucky actually I don't think I was using all uh, all skill to do that. I think it was uh, rather lucky that I that I managed to get that. There's been there were some cool kills in this this game as well. Um, I'll probably do a spotlight at some point um, on the other sniper rifles as well. I don't have any sales on this character, although that would be quite quite cool to do. Um, I saved this blueberry here. I think. Or at least it feels like I do in a second. You watch this. <laughs> but yeah, it would have been cool if I got this guy as well, but I didn't. Um, but yeah, I'll try get uh, some spotlights going of the other other sniper rifles, so you guys can see the differences. Um, and I'm sure they'll be pretty similar in um, in uh, Legion for those of you who will be playing Legion. So. Uh, you know, I'm pretty sure the sniper rifles will have similar similar uh, aspects to them, but I I will I will still record uh, the different spotlights when Legion comes out, so you guys can see as well. Um, but it should give you an idea if you're interested for Legion what to skill into and and maybe what what you don't want to skill into. So yeah, it could be could be a, a nice one to do. What what uh, sniper rifles do you guys like to use? Um, personally, a uh, charge is my favorite because um, if you can get those headshots, uh, it, it makes uh, a nice difference. So here, I only have one shot and I didn't check how many rounds are in the chamber, but I would have been able to get off that half shot as well uh, to probably kill that guy and then focus on this guy. You could see there I was going for the headshot and didn't go so well so I decided just get a body shot I was lucky that tank came around the corner and it just let me uh, sink that final shell in so that final round in should I say yeah um, what sniper rifles do you use and also what suits do you use them on uh, I'm finding this Kaldari commando with the charge is is nice I've only got it to three and proficiency two so I mean, if you have uh, five and five, or five and four, or something like that, the damage will be uh, incredible. I think that guy was lucky, <laughs> but yeah, the damage would be pretty, pretty cool. I think um, it would, it would. Uh, I mean, I'm one-shotting a lot of people already. If you're willing to put in that skill investment, I mean, it, it'll, it'll really, uh, really mean some nice kills. It's a shame you can't quick scope, but in a way it's nice that you don't get one shotted by snipers uh in the middle of uh, a close close quarters map, which is a good thing in my opinion. So it, it gives a more uh a different dynamic to the gameplay, so to speak. And again when especially when heavy suits are caught in the open the charge sniper is really nice because it gives you a lot of a lot of opportunity to to take your time weigh the shots and 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 kill the person one thing i would say um is i know a lot of people will say that oh it's unrealistic that the bullet doesn't curve um but to be fair uh the sniper this sniper rail rifle the bullet does apparently because it's a rail rifle you know the, all that and it's futuristic and all that travels at like 7000 meters a second or something crazy so if if that's the case then um yeah it should kind of uh hit inst you know hit where you point uh, there wouldn't be a huge in, in my opinion i might be scientifically wrong please let me know if i am <laughs> or not might be i most likely am <laughs> But yeah, so um, that kill was incredible. The, the LAV tried to kill that guy, swerved to try and hit him. He got stuck in the corner, and then I just sniped. That was really, uh, I, was, I was laughing when that happened. I couldn't believe it. 
so yeah that was a cool game uh, let me know I don't see a lot of uh, videos on sniping on on uh, on YouTube so I thought this would be a bit different as well I hope you guys enjoyed it uh, if you did please leave a like or comment below or on the and also on the forum post that I put on uh, the forums and uh, subscribe as well if you enjoy my videos uh, check out don't starve it's a new series I'm uh, trying to do with recording myself at the same time so yeah hope you guys enjoyed that let me know uh, if you want to see more thanks guys bye <laughs>